Libby here. As you can see, I'm in an unusual filming location and I'm joined by Rosie with her two balls. <laughs> Hope the lighting's okay in here. That's this um, Trying to find... She's going to be distracting, isn't she? Anyway, you can watch Rosie and you can listen to me. <laughs> I just wanted to film a quick a Wellness Wednesday video. I missed filming last week because it was crazy town around here. But I didn't want to make it not, I didn't want to miss today because next Wednesday's. Rosie, you look really silly. I didn't want to miss this Wednesday because next Wednesday's Christmas Day. But I wanted to film a quick update. Actually, I did film one last week, and if I can find the footage, I will insert it here. Just thought I'd do a quick Wellness Wednesday check in down at the river because it's a lovely day. Which view is going to be nicer for you? Maybe that one. Not facing to the sun. So. I'm just holding the dogs as well. There they are. Come on out walk. So, someone's coming, so we'll try and do this quick. So, the week weekend went really well. I was really happy with my food. If you saw my vlogs from Canberra, you know I ate really, really well. But unfortunately, I still come back a kilo. No, not a kilo, almost a kilo. About two pounds heavier than what I was before I went away. I can't just see what it was like, yeah, and what it was last Wednesday. So that's a bit disappointing, it's been a little bit discouraging because I feel like I just did so well. I didn't go to sugar, I ate pretty much as I normally would at home, but obviously you are eating out and probably eating higher salt, but I thought by now that might have sort of dropped off. Anyway, we just keep plodding onwards. Exercise has not been the best this week, very mixed. Um, I missed two workouts already, three I think this week, like three at home workouts. And last week again I was doing so well. I think it just sort of threw me a bit the weekend away, but anyway, not doing too bad. Back on track and um, just keep on keeping on. Um, okay, so that was last week's update. The, this, uh, this last week has gone pretty much the same. Nothing's really changed. I'm still amazed that I don't want sugar. Um, Amy made some chocolate chip cookies on Sunday. I think I might have had one on Tuesday and I had a half one today. Only because I had no cheer cookies. So I would have wanted I wanted a cheer cookie, but there wasn't any. So <laughs> never work with animals. So I really do think I am cured of any sugar addiction that I had before. Yeah, it's been a good week. Um, pretty much the same as the last number of weeks. The scales did see a nice shift this week. Um, so I've now lost 5.3 kilos, I think. Might be slightly over that, which is about 12 pound or nearly 12 pound. So might have been similar weight to last week. It went down and it went back up again. Um, and then it's gone back down again. So, but I'm happy I'm seeing new numbers that I haven't seen before. So I'm happy with that. I feel like I'm progressing. It is slow. I can't remember if that's been in six or seven weeks. Uh, and upstairs now, so <laughs> I can't look it up. Exercise, pretty atrocious. Um, last week, I did walk, do most of my normal walks, um, but I hadn't done any um, strength training work. But this week I have. I've, um, I did one on Monday, an overall, um, overall strength training on Monday, and then didn't do the last two days. And then today, I decided what I'll do every day, I'll go for my walk, and then I'll come back and I'll just do a very, very short session, about 15 minutes, and I'm going to alternate upper and lower body. And I think that way I'm going to get a lot more than I was doing before when I'm sort of thinking it's got to be, you know, 20 or 30 minutes um, at a time, because sort of, if I've got other things to do, it's hard to find that time. So I figured this would be better. I'll do something every day. Um, and I just, I come home from my walk and I went straight upstairs and straight into my, my upper body workout today. So got over and done, and then I cleaned the house and scrubbed the shower recesses. So the upper body got even more of a workout. But I think that would be a good strategy, at least until the New Year's. Um, I think I'll come into New Year's a lot stronger than what I am now. So that's good. Um, still doing the walks and that's a big thing and if I've got a bit of extra time I feel I could do a, a longer walk that day or I could try and get some yoga in too so that's where we are um, not much else to report I, really, I know this is a bit of a boring video but uh, this is a bit of a boring video there's nothing really ex much happening nothing much is changing I'm just doing the same things that I've been doing um, 
but it's really working for me. I, I just can't believe myself. Uh, I'm just, I'm not eating very much. I kind of think maybe I'm not eating enough. And maybe that's why my weight loss is slow, but it's, it's there. So I'm not too bad. It's five, five and a half kilos, near enough in seven weeks. That's pretty good. It's maybe six and a half. Oh, I don't know. Anyway, it's not a bad progress. <laughs> I'm sure come when we go out at Nelson Spay in just January, I'll be going, geez, I wish I was thinner and feeling bad for myself. But I, I haven't. Okay. Even the days, a few days I have sort of felt um, unhappy with my body. It hasn't made me want to eat. It hasn't made me turn to food. One day I was particularly stressed and I really did think, it was the first time I kind of thought I wanted something, but I wanted a cheer cookie. Didn't have any. Um, so I did have one of the Ghirardelli chocolates, but I had one and that was fine. I moved on. I wasn't then continually thinking about um, stuff. So I'm um, quite often forgetting to eat and I'm not interested in eating. So this is very, very foreign, weird territory for me to be in. Anyway, I will go because I'm just probably repeating the same stuff I repeat every week. Um, after, so I do a Wellness Wednesday video next week. I'll do one the week after and then maybe try and come up with a plan for going forward so I'm not boring you every week um, with this. Either I'll do them fortnightly or try and come up with a bit more, something more interesting to, to include in the videos. But it's been hard with the, doing vlogmas and vlogging every day to find time to um, film and edit these. Um, <laughs> anyway. I will go now, but I did want to update you before Christmas so you knew where I was. And I'm wearing clothes that I haven't worn before, and I've got a top ready for Christmas Day. It fits now. Um, Shoes have got a little bit better by Christmas Day, and I bought it last summer. I never wore it. I actually bought a hot pink one, I wore, and then I bought this one because it's a beautiful teal color and a size smaller because obviously I plan to lose weight. <laughs> and it hasn't fitted to now. So that's good. <laughs> Some of my clothes are starting to get a little bit big, but I think I'll manage for a few more weeks and then hopefully I'll find something in the wardrobe to replace those items with. But it's all good. Uh, can't complain about any, well, complain maybe, but no, can't complain about slow weight loss. It's, it is what it is. I didn't gain weight overnight. It's not going to go away overnight. And I know if I keep with it, I think if I keep with it by the end of the school holidays in six weeks, could be another four or five kilos lighter again. So. That'll be fantastic. So I'll just keep plodding along and um, we'll see how we go. Okay, I'll talk to you in two weeks' time for another Wellness Wednesday update. Okay, bye.